Yeah, yeah. Mm, mm, mm. Oh, he want that. Mm -hmm. Cali, what is up, YouTube? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Black Fairy. If you don't know who I am, stay tuned to find out, okay? Because it's lit over here, period. All right. I'm gonna do like a my everyday milf look because I was gonna be dramatic and do like a whole bunch of eyeshadow, this and that, and a third. But I'm gonna be very honest and truthful with y'all. I don't do all that every day. Y'all gonna see. I already got my lip gloss on. This is basically this is the lip gloss that I use every time it's the broadway honey hydrating lip gloss this is what i use on my lips and the only thing i can say about this is i hate the white line that it gives you you know like lip glosses that give you that white line i hate that and i could have sworn when i saw somebody talking about it on facebook they said that this doesn't do that but it does do that so i'm not even gonna hold you if you don't like that white line this is not for you. I'm just very cautious when I wear it, so I make sure that the white line is never there. Like, I just pay attention to it, like, over time. Like, you can tell when you've been wearing it for a little bit. You'll be like, okay, let me check on my phone, little mirror or whatever, to see if the white line is there. That's what I do, because that's annoying. <laughs> It's always my hair before my makeup. I don't care. I start my hair first because if my hair isn't right, my makeup won't come out right. I have to feel pride in myself when I'm doing my makeup. Like, ooh, yeah, girl, you about to look cute because your hair's already done. The whole look about to come together. If I do my makeup first, it's like... And so I do baby hairs and any foundation in a way if my makeup is already there. That's annoying. So I'm going to do two ponytails. I've been really into the two ponytails lately. What I do is I take these two little locks right here and I keep those out for like little bangs or whatever. I miss my cocoa butter kisses. Hope you smile when you listen. Ain't no competition. It's complete. like this like this is me to a T I'm not gonna hold y'all I'm not a hills girl I'm not a dress girl that ain't me but I do like wearing dresses sometimes I'm graphic tee sneakers jeans sweats but my face is always like makeup eyelashes baby hairs like you can see from the shirt I have one I have a metallica shirt on so this is my go-to style I take these two little pieces and I just throw them back because I'm about to do my baby hairs and I don't want them in the way. It's a little white from the scratchy. Ah, I almost pulled my hair out. I know it's way, way, way better ways to do your edges. This is preferably just for me and what I like, okay? <laughs> Got to be glue on my freaking edges. And the reason being is that... I used to use olive oil gel or I forgot what the gel is called on my edges but my hair sweats a lot and I have naturally curly puffy hair I think my hair is like a 4C so it like curls up a lot so this is the only thing that holds my edges down like it will curl up but not as much it does get white but to me it only gets white if you're like leaning on it or if you go to sleep with it on but for me, it gets white at the perfect time, which is at the end of the day when I get home or where I'm, wherever I'm at, and I just wash it off at nighttime with soap and water, and I wipe it off. Not go to bed. I use my trusty old toothbrush. I miss my cocoa butter kisses. Hope you smile when you listen. Ain't no competition. It's complete for attention.
you could just wipe that off with a um a little baby wipe with some alcohol alcohol the little you know the little spots you know that you don't want to be like white or anything but honestly i'm not gonna hold y'all <laughs> i never wipe it off unless i know i'm going out out then i'll really take my time but y'all can see like how i like it normally this is how my head is set up i always have three one two three baby hairs on this side and one two three on this side and then i always have the one in the middle which i either always swoop it this way or sometimes i swoop it that way but it's always going either way i never split it because i feel like that's too much baby hairs for me and i'll be needing all baby hairs so and you see how i just sit in there and it's holding i don't like my baby hairs too perfect because i feel like that's unrealistic if your baby hairs are too freaking perfect that's so freaking unrealistic like look at it it's just shining shining let me do a little a little close-up for y'all don't mind the access that's on it that you can see you can always wipe that off with alcohol but yes i don't like it perfect i like it to be a little curly then when it dries a little bit more I take these two and I leave it down like this but I'm probably like you see how this is looking already freaking cute <laughs> this is what I do being that I'm about to do my makeup I'm gonna flip them two things in the back fun fact I never got my eyebrows done ever in life um I don't know I just feel like once I get it done it's not gonna be like how I like it. Like I feel like my eyebrows is fine. Like they're not bad to me. So people who get their eyebrows done, they probably looking at my eyebrows right now. Like girl, you need to get your eyebrows done. But no, I don't. Leave me alone. I just took that out of my makeup step. I took doing my eyebrows out of my makeup step like a long time ago because I feel like it's too time consuming. Um, my eyebrows aren't that bad and i'd rather focus that on more stuff honestly i took a lot of things out of my makeup step like i don't do full face foundation anymore i do concealer and my dark spots which y'all about to see everything that i do literally mm -hmm. throw those back i take some concealer um this is elf's concealer 16 hour camo concealer i don't know the shade because the shade is missing from the bottom so yeah, I take this one I'm running out. <laughs> I gotta buy more. Natural light is so much, it works for me. So, you see the little dark spots under my eyes? I just do two dots. Two dots right there. I have black line right here. So, I do three dots one, two, three. And then one, two. I take this little brush right here. I bought these brushes, it's a brush set. It's by Bestop. However you pronounce this, I don't even know. It's not even focusing. It's an Amazon brand, and I took it, and I've been using it ever since. I love these brushes. They're so soft. So I just rub this in. Drunk, nigga. 
poppin' with a pocket full of cottage. Hey. Whoa, chemo, stop it, chop up, aim it, get your noggin'. Hey. Had to cut the out it, then the top I had to chop it. Still start. Niggas pocket watchin', so I gotta keep the rocket. Hey. Mama told me uh, not to sell word. Mama, 17, 5, same color t-shirt. What? Mama told me uh, not to sell word. Mama, 17, 5. I don't need that much, like foundation and stuff because i don't have dark spots on my face and i don't have um pimples or anything so i don't know what this is right here i think it's like a bump so i don't really have nothing that i need to cover besides like i have dark rings on my eyes it's not that dark but it's hereditary it runs in my family so it's a little dark and then i have dark lines right here right here right here and right here and I just mainly cover those. Like, those are the main things I cover. So, this is a wet eyeliner. I love doing cat eye. That is my signature look. I do cat eye all the time. And I just bought this eyeliner from, I think, the beauty supply store? Or Target? I don't know where I bought this from, but it's really good. I'm very, like, specific. Specific with my eyeliner. Especially wet eyeliner. Um, because I like the tip of it to be very pointy, like this. This is very pointy because I need to do my cat eye, like, perfectly. So if it ain't pointy, I don't want it. I'm probably gonna have to do this off camera. No. Okay, hopefully y'all can see me. I'm gonna drop that up. Uh, SPF, 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 Yeah, girl, don't be shy, just admit it. As soon as you do, you can come through and get it. Girl. We ain't gonna ask, girl. This is us, girl. Let me know what's up, girl. What's up, girl? Cause I'm gonna, 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 what's up, girl? Next thing that I always do is my mascara. It's right here. This is the Mega Volume Wet n Wild mascara. I'm very not picky when it comes, like when it comes to mascara. I really don't care because I wear fake eyelashes like literally all the time. So. I just do this before I put on fake eyelashes and period. You can't even tell the difference. And boom, this is my everyday makeup look. My signature hoop earrings. I don't even wear these hoop earrings all the time. I don't know why I'm saying my signature. You know what, today I'm gonna put one of these little should I put one of them back? Yeah, I'm gonna put one of them back. <laughs> I feel like when they're both down, I can't see my baby ears. <laughs> so I'm gonna put this one back. Boom. See, this, hair, this hairstyle is like so easy. It's like so easy to manage and everything. my little my little hoopity hoops the full effect I don't really care to do as much as I used to like I've been doing makeup probably since high school on myself and like learning every little thing on little details I need to know so I guess as I got older it got like boring um unnecessary um I do it sometimes when I'm like going out out like I do the full eyelashes, eyeshadow, 
highlighter like it's nothing wrong with doing none of that okay y'all be looking cute as hell with y'all full beat faces okay it's just not for me not for my everyday and the last thing that i'm gonna do for you guys because i don't think it would be right if i don't a little old makeup brush this is wet and wild um the pride metallic palette it's dirty yeah it's been with a bunch of makeup take this shade right here um i don't even know the color of it i'm gonna take this little golden shade and i always put it on my nose and the bridge of my nose lightly like it gives it shine as you can see i take that i put it right here it like gives my face some oomph <laughs> and I put it in the corner of my eyes like all right here and I put it in the corner of my other eye like that like you know that's what I do so this is what I, I look like every day every day like if i need to go somewhere like if i need to go somewhere real quick especially i feel like my makeup routine died down a lot because of the whole pandemic and we wasn't able to go anywhere we had to wear masks everywhere we still do so i really didn't care as much as about uh, like about foundation and stuff because you can't see my face because it's covered with a mask and I mainly just focus to under my eyes and just my eye makeup was very important to me that's the only thing that was important um so yeah you guys I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope you guys stay tuned for another freaking video period I love you guys so much press the notification bell to get notified every time I post a new freaking video period <laughs>